Actually, hey there, guys. This is the Rock and Lombax right here, and his assistant right here. Um, I'm Batman. That was the actual this is our review of my movie, The Dark Knight Rises. Yes, we're reviewing The Dark Knight Rises. Uh, actually, you give away my den. I'm walking with a cane. I'm <laughs> I'd actually expect Batman's all sad. The introduction, I did not like. Actually, I liked it. I liked it. I don't know why. It's I just, it actually, it's all bad. It's fatal. It's like he was walking on Darth Vader, like, actually, like, he just, like, blows yeah, up the plane. Like, it, <laughs> it introduced Bane too early to me, in my opinion. A dude, a dude, like, what are you waiting, like, five hours into the movie? And also, no, well, like, kind of between the start, beginning and the middle. Not the right, very beginning. much action at once. And actually, the middle is kind of the part where Bruce Wayne's like, I've got to become Batman. And now I must do I should say I get this leg patch because my cartilage broke. Yeah, it's just for Bane. And, 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 and also when Batman's fighting Bane, we're actually going to give you an, actually, actually he's Batman, I'm Bane. He actually blew my permission to die. <laughs> it's actually, it's like Batman isn't even trying. I mean, it's like his spire goes up to his penis. I'm 
then Lash did. <laughs> and actually, Matthew, why did you, oh, actually, why did Matthew do that? And actually, and also the colors are all, actually, like, red and blue all over the place, because the fingers are blue, and also the web shooters, just, okay. I like the Sam Raimi films, because, actually, a lot of you guys would just say, oh, you like campy style? No, I just grew up with those movies. I mean, and, I like, I mean, Spider-Man has been a huge part of my childhood. Sure, I'm still a kid, and, and I actually don't admire him as much as I did back then, but at least he was a good superhero, unlike, but actually, unlike most superheroes we grew up with. The thing is, that, like, the lizard is, like, terrible. I, but actually, I mean, I mean, the computer thing looks way too much like a DreamWorks movie. It actually looks more like a video game than a real-life lizard. And also, oh, like, I'm, I'm sick and tired with these double personalities. Does lizard really need a double-sided personality? I mean, we got that with the Green Goblin, Doc Ock, and Venom, and New Goblin, okay? Stop with the double-sided thing. Let's just have him be a, be, a, be a scientist who surprised people who wants to attack Spider-Man, not just have him a same person. And actually, actually, I also didn't really like, actually, actually, Gwen Stacy is good. Actually, she's like more, actually, like, she's more smart than Mary Jane, but, oh, oh but it's just, yeah, yeah, I just, I just, I grew up with those films, so, uh, so final verdict for the amazing, horrible man is a very low 5 out of 10. I mean, I didn't think it was terrible. Some of the action was really, really good. Some of the action was great. I mean, like, it actually, the effects look way, way, way better than the first. Like, sure, I'm sure the first one still looks amazing. But, but, oh, but when you swing, seeing him swing through the city, it actually looks like he's there, but, but come on, you can't just let effects and, like, action, and, and also, the, also the beginning, just felt like way too much like the other films, and also, like, they throw all the money into the end, why can't you do that with, like, the beginning, anyway, this is Rocket Mom back saying goodbye, and watch movies, and game on, do 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 do